What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Call of Duty Modern Warfare and today we did receive update 1.15. This is about a 7 gig update on PS4. Uh, a little bit bigger of course on Xbox and PC. Uh, Xbox is around 11 gigs, PC is around 10 gigs. Now of course with this update we did get the new gunfight map Bazaar. I added Shoot House to uh, an existing playlist with Shipment and Rust called Dirty Old Houseboat. 3v3 snipers on rust, giant infection, and boots on the ground war, which is realism rules with no tanks. Um, also, in this update, we did receive a lot of general fixes and some challenge fixes, weapon fixes, that kind of thing. We'll go ahead and get right into that. I will link all of this down in the description if you guys would like to read over it for yourself. They fixed a bug where friends who are online and social tab were not always appearing at the top of the list. Various map exploit fixes fixed for some players. Seeing an incorrect career level, most fixes to uh, regiment tags, also fixed for the some players encountering an issue with their mouse stop working after the last title update. Also fixed a bug in 3v3 gunfight mode, fixed a spawn exploit on vacant, fix uh, for white phosphorus killing all players instantly when in realism mode. Uh, fix for the score at the end of fire in the hole not tallying up properly, fix for the bug of uh, for the kills with enemy weapon challenge. Fix daily challenges that require you to get an X number of kills with an enemy weapon. Fix for an objective when completing Golem's uh, operator mission that requested 5 kills. Also the Alliance Objective 6 and Alliance Objective 2 also got fixes for those challenges as well. The Striker 45 fixed range and ADS speed to match the description of the three, uh, 300 millimeter poly barrel. Model 680 slight range increase. The Model 680 XRK. Uh, short range increase, slight range decrease, and ADS increase to the following. The Model 680 uh, XRK 18.0 Liberator, the 890 or the 89-0 Force Tac Sentry, and the Origin 12 Forge Tac Precision. Underbarrel shotguns got an increased pellet count, reducing uh, reduced rate of fire and increased shell count. Also, the crossbow got an increased reload speed. Fixed a bug where the Akimbo Snake Shot 357s did not register damage. Also, re, uh, reduced recoil to the SA87 12.4 factory barrel. Also, they in increased the close and mid range damage for the AK uh, 5.45 times 39 millimeter round mag. Also, they fixed for graphical bug on uh, Disinform Special Operations on Xbox. Uh, the survival mode, uh, they changed some things with Piccadilly, adjusted the cluster strike damage towards enemy helicopters as well. Special operations, they also did some things uh, kind of going forward to fix some of the bugs within operations. The Call of Duty League and the Codcaster mode also have some changes. I'm not going to go over those. You guys can read those down in the patch notes if you would like. And several fixes to prevent crashes and improve stability on PC, which is the normal thing that we always get for PC kind of at the bottom. The one thing that I wasn't really excited about uh, when I read it, of course, was the boots on the ground war, realism rules, no tank. I was kind of hoping the boots on the ground um, ground war was going to be in all modes, not just in realism mode. So hopefully that will change later on. I was wanting a, you know, boots on the ground, no tank kind of thing for ground war, but not to be just in realism, in realism mode. I wanted it in regular mode as well. But anyway, guys, leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, Please do so. If you are a subscriber, make sure you click that bell icon in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. If you have a chance, share the video. It does help out the channel a lot. And be sure to check out GT Racing. They are the affiliate here on the channel. They do sell gaming chairs and office chairs. All their information is linked down in the description. I'm just going to let the video play on out, guys. If you want to watch it, it's only about another minute or two. If you want to watch these kill streaks go out, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.